the age of destiny was truly fascinating. My favorite age is the sausage. What? What's up guys, I'm Jason Ski. welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Pathfinder Kingmaker and the Barony of Alondra. If this is your first time on the channel, please make sure you go down below and check out the beginning of this playlist so you know where we are right now because you have no idea where we are. And check out last episode if you missed last episode, all of that is down in the description below. But if you are up to date, we are going to go and do some more stuff here today. We've got stuns of events going on in the kingdom. We've got go our own quests going on. And so what we're going to do actually is I just remembered that we promised Davik Nettle that we would kill the Stag Lord. And we've done that. And we need to go talk to Davik Nettle. And he's all the way up here still at Nettle's Crossing, I'm pretty sure. So we're going to go over there and see what he has for us. Because he said he had something for us. A spear. Once we killed the... Staggler for him and we're gonna try to avoid these random encounters as best we can Yeah, we're gonna evade them because I just don't want to even deal with them right now I just want to get over there and then we're gonna check out this retina kill place because it's a location that we've never seen before All right, everyone is Exhausted, so we're gonna go ahead and camp real quick most nobles I've seen were arrogant even with their equals and you aren't ashamed to be sharing a meal with former slaves I've lived among mercenaries for a long time, and they're a motley bunch, from nobles to branded convicts. In a situation like that, you quickly learn to judge people by what they do, not by the color of their coat of arms, or how ancient their lineage is. Very well said, Valerie. Alrighty. Everyone's good to go, and now we're going to go ahead and go inside and talk to Davik Nettle. That weird undead guy that he is. Davik, are you still down here, buddy? Davik? There he is. Staglord is dead. Phrasma waits. Farewell, Alendin. Corpse crumples to the ground. Well, that was anticlimactic. What do you have on him, Valerie? A short spear. Just a, just a simple short spear. Oh my god, we got so much garbage in here. Oh my goodness, this is ridiculous. We're gonna have to do something about this. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, this is a short spear plus one. Uh, not, nothing too crazy about it, really. Um, I guess we could give it to someone who might end up in melee by accident. So we'll just give that to... We'll just give that to Lindsay, why not? Okay. That was a little bit less interesting than I thought it would be, but whatever. All right, well, um, I guess we're done with the Davik's Crossing. I mean, maybe we can find a, maybe we can repair this bridge at some point. We'll have to check that out later. All right, now since we sell things with, uh, oh, I missed a mull upon a resource area in your travels to reap its benefits. You need to claim the corresponding region. Turn to the resource location and claim it for 15 BP. Well, what's our BP right now? I don't know how much BP we have. Uh, can I check that? What's our, what's our BP right now? We have 200, we have a plenty of BP. Uh, Aram, you're busy rebuilding the temple of the elk, so we won't have you do that. But we can go and claim some of these resources. So I think that's what we should do. Because they can get some culture, some loyalty. I think... That'll be an excellent plan. But first, ooh, what's that? Oh, that's Thorndale. Okay. And I've never been there yet, so we should probably check out uh, Thorndale and, you know, see how it's doing and stuff since we established it. Awesome. All right, we're going to go to Ratnook Hill and check it out first. Also, I'm going to be trying to keep these episodes a little bit shorter so that, In due time. you know, they don't drag on as much because I know they tend to with a lot of the combat and the dialogue, so... Mutilated body. Looks like it was eaten by some rodents. Uh-oh, are we going to be fighting rodents of unusual size? Follow my lead. All right. We're going to go in. I'm not afraid. Oh, that's a were-rat! Kill it! Kill him with fire! Damn, they're tough. 
Ah, that bastard. I'll charge that one. Oh, my charge was like instant because I was ready for it. Got ya. Jeez. Ooh, maybe I should get out of the fire. Well, they had plenty of magic weapons on them, that's for sure. Wow, they had a lot of magic items in general. And we'll look. Oh my god, treasure! Woo! So there's some were rats hiding out in here. Just preying on unsuspecting travelers. That's awful. So looks like we've cleared out the area. That's good. Man, were rats. Who would have thunk it? All right, back on the map here, and now we're gonna go check out these excavation sites and stuff, because I wanna try to get these uh, resources for us. All right, it's nighttime. I think it's time, good time to camp, since everyone's a little beat up. Uh, we're gonna manage this real quick and put Harem on a ability here. Uh, we're gonna have. I always want to make sure that the meal happens. So we're gonna have, uh, go ahead and have Octavia help her on cooking. What god do the six bears venerate? The men? Oh, Gorum, of course. Because they're all such great warriors, you know. As for the women, they worship either their ancestors or Erastil. They tried to stop me from praying to Gorum, but I smashed a couple of mugs, and they left me be. Damn straight, Amiri. You worship whoever you want to worship. All right, we're all healed up. Let's go in here and claim this. Is it just... Oh, we just... we just It's ours. It's just ours. All right, we'll go on up. We'll grab a few more resources. And then we'll check in at the village of Thorndale. See how things are there. All right, we went ahead and stopped in at Oleg's post. Because I want to make sure we got... Because... I want to get rid of some of this treasure we have, and it seems like Oleg's place is the best place to sell some stuff off. So, uh, show me your wares, Oleg. I'll be right back after we sold a bunch of stuff. All right, so we came out of that with an extra, like, 3,000 gold, and I am going to be giving some new gear to a few of our people. Lindsay's going to wear this padded armor because it is the same AC she was already had, but it uh, will be lighter for her so her spells won't fail as much. We're going to give this dexterity belt to her as well because she is a dex character being a bard and everything. And then this headband of vast intelligence. That seems like it gives plus two intelligence enhancement. That's like crazy good for a wizard. So, and this is an ambulance of some sort. We're just going to keep it on us. But we came here, we got what we needed, and now we're going to go back and check out that last site and then check out the village. So let's go do that real quick. The age of destiny was truly fascinating. My favorite age is the sausage. What? All right, we're just outside of Thorndale. Let's check it out. See if it, we can actually like go in. Yes, we can. We can enter this location. Here are the guards just under the village. Oh, and there is a traitor here. That's good to know. He just has to- Ooh, he has camping supplies and rations. That's really cool. Uh, I want to buy, like, like, ten of that, man. That's awesome. That'll be helping us a lot. Time. Just want to explore what we can find of this village and see what's around. I think there's a tavern here. No, we can't even go inside there. All according to plan. There's people, you know. There's a priest here. That's cool. Better than himself. We can go inside this little house here. Why would we though? Well, what's inside? Nothing. It's just an empty house. As it should be. All right. Well, it's good to know that there is a place here to sell our goods. Can we actually get healed by this priest? Uh, yes, we could. All right, that's awesome. All right. Well, we. I, I like this little Thorndale village place. It's pretty cool. All right, we're going to go ahead and take our leave now, people of Thorndale. You go on and keep living your lovely lives and enjoy your time in the Barony of Alondra.
All right, I think it's time to check on the kingdom and see how we're doing. All right, events. She has five days left. We have this troubled lands thing here. We've completed that. Uh, do we have any other projects we need to work on? Trade. Oh yeah, the trade agreement. We need to work on the trade agreement. I uh, can. We have no advice. We have no candidates available for this position. Uh, Aram's already doing that. Yeah, well, it looks like. Let's go ahead and wait and see until Amiri's done with her thing. Oh, trade taxes. Some half-elf trading fabric in the capital discovered a loophole in the law, which made it possible to avoid paying most taxes. The news spread quickly throughout the Merchant's Guild. Measures should be taken immediately or the treasury will take a loss. She's an advisor to handle this event. Tristian, handle it, please. Uh, he has a 80% chance of success. He'll probably do fine. Oh, uh, yes, and here is... Yeah, the issue with... I think this might be an issue with... That's different, actually. I don't know why it has that weird symbol there. Uh, the troll invasion. We need to deal with that somewhere in the Gnarl Marshes. I think it's down here? Southern Gnarl Marshes? We'll have to check that out next time. And then we'll go ahead one more day and... All right, event of the month. The locals are bored and don't know what to do with themselves. Oh, okay. Every event can resolve in one of the four ways. Disaster, failure, success, or triumph. Okay. Two times of events, problems, opportunities. If a problem event ends with a failure, it decreases your stats. If it ends with a success, it has no effect. Succeeding an opportunity will increase your stats and will normally not affect them if the outcome is a failure. Got it. It was a triumph. Millage Parade made the locals proud. How strong the barony has become over the past few months. A flood of volunteers have joined the army. Plus four to military, plus one to all our other stats too. And then the troll sightings. Bands of marauding trolls have been seen throughout the region. The people are frightened and beg for protection. Well, we know who, does she need, who needs to deal with this. And I'm going to make sure that she succeeds in that. And then we'll go back down south and make sure that these trolls don't become a problem in the next episode. We went ahead and dealt with some more issues in town. Uh, well, in the barony, we went and talked to Davik. We went and visited Thorndale, gathered up some resources. And now I think in the next episode, it's time to get back on track and deal with these trolls. So if you like this episode, please leave a like and comment down below. Subscribe and make sure you ring that bell notification button so you always know when the next episode comes out. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Farewell.